Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Chemvis. In this video we are going to discuss Neff reaction. Here we will discuss the following points. What is Neff reaction? Mechanism of Neff reaction, modified Neff reaction and applications of Neff reaction. Neff reaction is the acidic hydrolysis of primary nitronate salt to produce aldehyde and secondary nitronate salt to produce ketone. The first reported example of Neff reaction is the conversion of nitroethane to acetaldehyde. Here, the nitroethane is first allowed to react with sodium hydroxide to produce primary nitronate salt, which is the substrate for the Neff reaction, and then it is allowed to hydrolyze with 4 molar aqueous H2SO4 to produce acetaldehyde. Mechanism of Neff reaction Nitronate salt under a strong acidic condition undergoes kinetic protonation at oxygen atom to produce nitronic acid 2 which again undergoes protonation on the second oxygen atom to produce imenium ion 3. This imenium ion has a strong electrophilic carbon atom due to positive charge on the nitrogen atom. In the reaction medium, water is the only nucleophile. So, addition of water molecule to imenium ion like this produces species 4 which after proton exchange gives species 5. 5 then undergoes loss of proton and water to produce nitrosoalkanal 6. Nitrosoalkanal 6 undergoes protonation at nitrogen atom to produce species 7, which after loss of hyponitrous acid produces protonated carbonyl compound 8. Carbonyl compound 8 undergoes deprotonation to produce carbonyl compound. Hyponitrous acid decomposes to water and nitrous oxide. Now we will discuss some modified conditions for the Neff reaction. First is DBU promoted Neff reaction. In this secondary nitroalkanes are allowed to stir at 60 degree centigrade in acetonitrile to produce ketone. Primary nitroalkanes don't react at all. Deprotonation of nitroalkane gives DBU complex with nitronate ion which is in equilibrium with N-hydroxyl oxygeridine and hydroxy nitrosoalkane. Loss of hyponitrous acid gives ketone. The second modified condition is sodium methoxide on silica gel. Sodium methoxide on silica gel is an excellent reagent for the Neff reaction. The reaction are run either at room temperature or at 80 degree centigrade for a short period of time. For example, reaction of nitrocyclohexane with sodium methoxide and silica gel gives cyclohexanone with 99% yield. Oxidative methods Oxidative methods involve reaction of nitronate ion with KMnO4, oxone, dimethyl dioxirane, MCPBA, H2O2, seric ammonium nitrate or ozone followed by dimethyl sulfide. In the case of KMnO4, oxone, dimethyl dioxirane, MCPBA and H2O2, the nitronate ion aids oxygen to the double bond to produce oxyridine dioxide, which eliminates nitrate ion like this to produce aldehyde or ketone. Reductive method. In reductive method, Nitroalkane itself is treated with titanium trichloride in water and THF or DME to produce aldehyde or ketone. 
This is also called McMurray method. Now we will discuss general applications of nephroaxin. Nitroalkane 1 in the presence of a suitable base produces nitronate ion 2 which can react with a variety of electrophiles. It reacts with alkyl halide to produce nitroalkane 3 with aldehyde beta hydroxy nitroalkane and with alpha beta unsaturated compounds gamma nitrocarbonyl compound 5. These compounds 3, 4 and 5 after nephroaxin respectively give aldehyde R ketone 6, alpha hydroxy ketone 7 and 1, 4 dicarbonyl compound 8. One thing which is to be noted here is that in the nitronate ion the polarity of this carbon is negative while in the carbonyl compound in the product derived from the same carbon has positive polarity since there is reversal of polarity of carbon during the synthesis so this is an example of Ampelung strategy for the synthesis of carbonyl compounds that's all in this video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon if you like this video thank you very much for watching this video